<laughs> All right, game looks pretty good. So this was not an N64 game in my youth. I think I mentioned before, the only ones for me were really um, Ocarina of Time, Banjo-Kazooie, and Banjo-Tooie. But nice to see that we have a rareware game here. Select file. Select mission. Damn. All right, well, that file appears to be nothing in it. Uh, so you have agent, secret See, agent. So this is your difficulty. Uh, I'll pick agent. Yeah, just, <laughs> yes. yeah, just a regular okay. agent. Are we up? Ghostbusters, what's that, lol? Uh, uh, still waiting, just a moment. Confession, I never actually saw Ghostbusters until two years ago. Wow. Yeah. For a while, that was my default, like, what, what, you haven't seen that movie kind of thing? But now it's The Big Lebowski. I've never seen The Big Lebowski. The Big Lebowski's good. Mm -hmm. It's not a favorite of mine, but I like it. It's just as far as, like, movie cultural heritage. It often incenses people. Does it incense you, Gengar? Gengar, what incenses you? Ghostbusters is my longest running favorite movie. It has been mm. a favorite movie of mine since I was four years old. So. Love it. Favorite orchestra? Gotta say the Washington Metropolitan Gamer Symphony Orchestra. And I hope you can all come to our concert. All right. Get it started, Tracy. Agent. Bungee jump from platform. Yes, I hear there's a show around this area at the end of June, is that correct? Yeah, June 27th at Dominion High School. Thank you for the plug. <laughs> But feel free to go to WMGSO.org to check us out. Well, now I have to jump off a dam, apparently. Oh, nine years ago I jumped off a dam. In Goldeneye, if you beat the first level at Agent, you can only play subsequent levels on Agent until you beat it as Secret or Double O. Oh, okay. Dang. Well, this is me. As her first playthrough, I think... This is still the same project. Can I join? I play trombone, says... Uh, <laughs> well, Subaru. sure you can, Ada Subaru. Ow! Jerk! Check out their website for the Washington Symphony Game Orchestra. Did I get the... Oh, very close. Washington Metropolitan Game Orchestra. Metropolitan. Right. <laughs> we have lots of politans around here. They're very metro. <laughs> I don't include that. Alright, well I've got this bigger gun now, so I feel pretty good about that. I'm crouched and waiting. Ruffle his face. Why is he so happy? He's oh, a no, he does. Or something. I have a scope. How do I use this? I got him! I got him! Oh man, that rare wear music! <laughs> so good first time. In a limited format. Am I in a still on stairs? Does that move? Escalator? Oh, that I don't think so. I don't think so. So can I not move and target at the same time? Um, I don't know. I'm not that good mm -hmm. at, uh... I don't think you can, but if I'm crouching and say, like, from cover, I think I can do it. Maybe someone in chat knows. Uh, Redmaker says, just out of curiosity, have you ever played Goldmine with these two controller layouts? What? Is that two controller layouts? No, no, where's my gun? And EB Subaru says, okay, I gotta go hang with Claire. Say hi to Jacob for me. These things can be done, probably. Thanks for hanging out. Catch you later. Alright, I'm um, get, getting some guys so far. Oh, you 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 look sick. You should sit down. Hey, some guys! Ow! Ah, run away! Run away! Run away! Up uh, here! To this place! Where is man? There is man! Oh, this might be useful in story mode. I think it looks good. 
I picked it up and now I'm going down the stairs back to where those guys were in their bunker. Mm-hmm. Man, the lyrics to this song are really specific. I know! <laughs> I, that's where I came from. As in, you have two sticks, plays more like a modern console of shooters. That oh, would, would be amazing! Because, yeah, I've gotten so used to the two stick thing over the last few years, it's really hard for me to use Goldeneye. You can't move while aiming in Goldeneye's sad face. You can change the layout such that the control stick changes where you're facing, and the digital pad makes you walk straight, but looking is not the same as aiming. Shoot those guys in the faces. In the faces! You can do it! I think, oh, they, in their final death throes, tried to go through, oh, you're still alive. You don't look very happy, do you? I know. Finally! <laughs> Lord! Fun fact, I had to set every console shooter to left-handed layout, thanks to the N64. <laughs> Fair <laughs> enough. I hacked an N64 emulator once to make it almost use mouse slash WSAD controls. It was kind of neat. Well, good job, Schumann. I was used to that stick equals left thumb, but normally you look around with the right stick. Says Red Maker. Yeah. Oh, okay, I see. I'm used to shooting with A. Yeah, right in the gut. Anybody up here who caused me trouble? Not that I can see. Oh no, they know I'm here now. Some mans. Mans are here. Not the mans. Take a very long time to fall down, sir. to defuse the two bombs on the ship, but you have to fire the bomb diffuser using the Z button. If you use it instead with the B button, James Bond will use the bomb with predictable what? results. What? Well, we'll watch out for that if we get to the frigate level, because that would not be Thanks good. for the warning. You're supposed to use it, but don't use the use button. Use the Z button to shoot it. Alright, that's wonderful. Yeah, that's right. Whoa! Big jerk. Big jerk. Ammo for me. Ammo for free. Firing at me through a wall. I'll just go this way, I think. He hopped. He hopped to the right. Alright, I think I'm ready for some uh, Halo now. <laughs> Oh, Ridmaker says in response to Shuma's thing about the frigate level in the box, let's not talk about the times that I died because of that. Okay. Yeah, that's frustrating. Oh, you, you, you are not my friend at all. You're old. You're shooting me point blank with an assault rifle. And you're just, just, just hold on, just hold on. We made it in. Uh, I'm underground somewhere. I'm assuming I'm going the right way. <laughs> Why is there no dinner like in Wolfenstein? <laughs> yeah, where are the turkey legs on the floor and the golden chalices? Yeah. I demand a refund. Oh, anyway, you remind me that I still have to finish Perfect Dark on Perfect again. There's still some stages left before I finally got that. Whoa, Redmaker, whoa. And I got it since release. Let's also not talk about that. 
Since you're, <clears throat> think of it that like the higher the difficulty, it's not necessarily more dudes, but it's more objectives. Mm, okay. So I may not necessarily be going the right way. Yeah, so you're not going the wrong way. Not going the wrong way. I'll just have more things to do. Play through GoldenEye on the hardest difficulty, then you unlock a new one, then you can see how good the AI can. You can set how good. AI can see you because they're good oh, cool. at shooting, etc. Just some AI variations, but really fun to experiment with. Alright, I'm out here now. There's some poison. Is where I bungee jump? Um, where do I bungee jump? No, Somewhere next. you need to be up there. Okay. Keep going, though. I think you're going Alright, right, where's the ladder? At least yes, right yeah. That's a good start. Up, up, up we go. Bungee jump. Here we go. There we go. Uh, <laughs> I'm here, maybe? No, no, I'm where you were oh. standing. Go, 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 go. I think I'm not mistaken, that's it. Yep, you did it. Woo! Well, <laughs> look at that pixelation. <laughs> Facility right before you get to the intersection, there's a sign over the door that has a James Bond silhouette on it. There's a red null sign, circle and slash. Like the no ghosts. God, I, I don't. Oh, I do. I have my no ghosts. In Evil Tim's amazing but incomplete LP of Goldeneye, he glances up and remarks, What an oddly specific word. <laughs> Alright, well, I think we got to the laboratory area to rendezvous with Sean Bean, destroy the boiler room. But don't shoot the scientists. Yep. Someone actually got to our website, I'm looking at our stats, by doing a Google search or something search for Jackie Chan and Chris Tucker. So. <laughs> great, great. Well, feel free to donate for Jackie Chan and Chris Tucker. Oh my god, there's a guy. Yep, yep. We don't have Chris Tucker, but we do have Jackie Chan Stuntmaster. So... That's it. That's a thing. There's a guy behind. I know. I guess it's locked. That's right. Haha, -ha, you died when you were pooping. My toilet! Oh gosh. Headshot. You're ruthless. It's like right in his throat. No, Marseille. Yeah. 
Oh, okay. Everyone now took I got a bathroom really. break at the same time. I guess so. Yes. This is their bathroom. scheduled bathroom break, and you are interrupting it, Mr. That's right. Bond. I am the bathroom interrupter. Agent oh. bathroom. <laughs> bathroom interrupter. Double Tracy, this is why we don't hang out. <laughs> 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 oh, someone spilled barbecue sauce all over him. There's a dummied out item in the dam level called the Peaton Gun, which suggests that when you jumped off the dam, you're supposed to have to fire the Peaton Gun the way Pierce Brosnan does in the film, which would have been the world's first quick time event. Very <laughs> thought. I like it. I'm getting more accurate with this thing though. I'm not trying to use the scope. From it's Gary Kibler. I I think she might be typing more. Oh. Oh no. Let's try this one. There's another bathroom. Going down some halls. Gotcha. Take care of him. Take care of him. Oh, his hat. That's quite a hat you got there. Are you a German military. Clarence B. Key card. Now you can go towards the hook. Towards the hook? Where is Grant, and how come Gold and I have negative 15,000 points? Oops! Sounds like there might have been uh, an error. Error! In the time played ranking. Uh, it should have zero points right now because every time we play a game, it loses its accumulated points. But we are playing right now because of Gary's contribution, so thank you. Um, and as to where is Grant, he is supposed to be driving here right now to get some fried chicken. Because we had a food donation! Yeah. That includes delicious fried chicken. Uh, and, um... There's some fire. That is from, uh... To your right, to your right, one of those boxes. Passion Food Hospitality donated dinner, so, uh... Grant should be on his way to come so, get it. you want to go? <laughs> he was sleeping, as he should have been, because he was here until 8 a.m. Okay. He was here all night, so he went home, he slept. Uh, Leecher Mods, that was my bad. How do I fix this? Um, like towards the facility. So in the, uh, in the rankings document, just um, change the negative number in the first tab to the correct negative number. <laughs> Your, the, the last one that you did there. Um, what does it say? It says Nick. Oh, I think you got it already. Yeah, you got it by the time I even looked at it. Uh, no, tell, it should be zero. Tell Grant to play GoldenEye and, and eliminate, eliminate Russians. Russians. Tell me to do something. All right, I need to, to activate. I activated the security door. Was that not right? It says Yay, it has been activated. Yeah, mods, yeah, perfect. It happens. It's there's so many typos. You open the happen. other door. All right, uh, maybe but it's, it's funny. another room. Negative yeah. fifteen thousand points. It'd be fun to do a fundraiser sometime to figure out how to do it like a coin board. I don't know how you'd do that online, but it'd be fun to figure it out. Maybe you could do like okay. competing. Uh, go, 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 go. Now. Oh, okay. Drive. Yeah, it's like timed. Okay. Now it's something where you can vote both for and against things with your donations. That would be a lot of fun. Ah, too slow. Also, Manitoba Burns says, hey guys! Hey, Manitoba Burns! Hey, Manny! <laughs> oh, Manny. Michi Mod says, uh, my yeah. finger slipped. Back. Yeah, yeah. It, totally, it totally happens. Yeah. 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 It's totally fixable. Yeah. I'm sure we would have noticed it when we went to spin the wheel in half an hour anyway. If you tell me I look like Pierce Brosnan, I send more money. Chip, you wanna, you wanna do that one? <laughs> Mr. Killer, you look exactly like Pierce Brosnan. Maybe even more handsome. <laughs> Do not shoot that sign. <laughs> Were you getting shot at? Oh, that guy at the door. Oh, and also that guy you should have just executed. Executed. Oh, he threw a grenade? Jerk! Execute. Look at his face. Thank you, Chip. He looks like Napoleon You're welcome, Dynamite. Sir. <laughs> Chip is happy to do it. <laughs> uh, no, you can't go out that way yet. Right in that crotch. Ah, oh, you tried to dive. Dude, you're so uh, Never! Turn around, turn around, bad guys. 
just, just let him keep going. Just get him. La 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 la. La 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 la. Now they're behind you. Now they're ahead of you. La 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 la. You're allowed to accidentally, or accidentally, take out one scientist before you fail the mission for scientific casualties. Uh. Back up. Tracy leaves a trail of bodies wherever she goes. <laughs> That's right. Seriously. And you will know me by my trail of dead. Okay. Okay, so, so. Uh, that was like 80 guys. Well, I think they're out of personnel. Oh, ah, no, it's for you, Schmagiggy. Ah, uh, yes, Schmagiggy. Then you, Schmagiggy. We're just supposed to. If you menace the scientist a bit, he'll pull a uh, dose. Man, I can't read Russian. Uh, Dostove. Dostove on you? Dostove. Okay, so I thought I could cut some footage, but it seems I'm stuck to this stream now. <laughs> <laughs> You live here now. Welcome. I do. I do. Which is marginally more powerful than your PB7 and holds one extra bullet. Ah, ba, 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 you jerk. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna follow you. I think. No, no, behind you, behind you, behind you. Leechy Mod shared in the chat uh, a mashup of uh, a GoldenEye hip hop mashup, Golden Fly. Awesome. From a New York hip hop producer, Alex Love it. Kresovich. 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 Did he go back down to where I wanted him to go? Especially since I've just killed Sony Vegas with throwing in my six hour recording session. The well then, more stream Do I just it is! Keep going, I guess, or? More stream! Yeah, I'm not really sure. Right, well, I'll just keep going until Mission and Feral because I got shot so much. I'm James Bond, I got shot ten times and I'm still walking. Yeah, you're fine. You're, fine. you're trying to find Dr. Doak. I remember that much. There's like one doctor who will give you a uh, security key or something. I just like a certain amount of balance. <laughs> Honestly, I like this stream because I don't have to talk. That's yeah. a nice, yeah. you know. That makes I'll total take it. sense. It's a way to do it. But we love when you do. <laughs> okay. Okay, this is where you want to be. Oh, that's right. I have to shoot uh, the tanks. You have to. Uh, like 006 first. Yeah, okay. 006 is there, and then you have to put remote mines in between the tanks and then okay. set them all up. So and maybe you get five remote mines at the start of the level, but if your placement of you the mines on the tanks is careful, you can do it with like three. <laughs> you, you killed 006. It's impossible to solve the mission now. Oh no! <laughs> six hours of recording <laughs> equals six hours of talking. You don't want to know how my throat feels right now. We have some idea, though. <laughs> Thankfully, there are multiple of us, and we don't have to all talk constantly, but... I and don't yeah, know what for you You need to find Dr. Doak, who is named Dr. Doak, or David Doak, one of the people who worked on the game in some capacity, but his location was randomized. Ah, uh, I killed 006. Yeah. <laughs> I killed 006. We'll just rendezvous with the dead guy. On Betrayal! The Sean Bean, every time. Every time. Never be safe for me, Sean Bean. Yeah, see, failed. Failed. Oh. But, not a lot of dead scientists. That's there pretty good. was a donation oh. from Gary Kibler. Hey! hey. GoldenEye007. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for your compliment, even though you lie. <laughs> he accused you of lying, Chip. No, no. Embellishing. Taking the truth and decorating. So is there a way to refill your health? I don't think there is. <laughs> oh man. Goldeneye is just gonna stay on the rankings. Like every time we play it, another donation comes in for it. It's like, it's this year's Super Mario 64. Which is also a game that you could donate for. You should. Super that is Mario super 64. Fun game. You should do it because um, if it comes up on Grant's shift, which is, let me see, uh, at tomorrow? midnight, okay. midnight tonight, uh, he will speed run it. He can do it in under an hour. So you'll see the whole game, or well. You'll see the expurgated version. Yeah, you'll see, you'll see the ending of the game and the beginning of the game, <laughs> and some stuff in the middle. Um, <laughs> Chloe says, Stephanie dodged Hello Kitty and Battletoads? How you do that? How you do that? Yeah, the wheel and I are friends this year. 
<laughs> in the past, we've had our differences, mostly Dr. Gyarados' fault. Um, Schumann says, no way to refill your health, but finding body armor sort of has the same effect. Um, that yeah. Oh, and also, if there's a hissing noise, something has probably gone wrong. Yeah. Um, never do these kinds of marathons alone, please. It's not healthy, says Redmaker. Very true, very true. The first year, I was the only player. We went for 25, 26 hours. And uh, being allergic to caffeine, I did pass out in the middle. And Grant had to play Skyrim for like two hours to keep it going. Thankfully, he was there to do that. But everyone else who was helping in other capacities, uh, what were my last two hours? Um, <laughs> stuff. Let me see. So I played, wow, I can't even remember. Mystery Game. Yes, Mystery Game. Which was WarioWare. Wario. And before that was Red Dead Redemption. Yes. So that was a lot of fun. Um, I would play more Red Dead. I'm not good at oh, it. Yeah. Yeah. 26 hours alone is a bad idea. Oh, do you mean the last two hours of the ge of year one? Look at your ugly God, face. I down. Somewhere there's probably a Google Doc that can tell us. Anything Actually, in us? our U Pick VG folder, it's probably in there. But um, yeah. Well, the problem with the first year and why we do it the way we do it now is that back then. Every dollar you donated was a minute of any game you wanted. So, you know, if Your someone donated $180, which <laughs> two people did, they got three hours of those games. And so we didn't know how long we were going to go for, because it all depended on how many donations. Um, so, and people could elongate the broadcast by donating at the last minute, which someone did. And I played Snake for the end. Um, but yeah, I was ready to pass out again by that point. More friends, yay! Hopefully, how are you doing? So, yes, I don't recommend um, doing a marathon on your own if it is longer than... Like, I think a person can do a 24-hour marathon, and you need help. You need, like, people to do other things and to bring you water and to relieve you so you can go to the bathroom and stuff, but you can do it. Um, especially if you can have caffeine, unlike me. But, uh, I don't, I mean, I recommend help, no matter what. Friends are good. Um, yeah, shifts are pretty much hey. the best thing ever. You are right, Redmaker. Oh, uh, thanks, Redmaker. Be back up. Thank you for stopping by. Be back up. We'll catch us tomorrow then. Yes, yes, we will be here. We will. <laughs> 26 hours awake is a bad idea, says Schumann. The longest I ever stayed up was, I think, 27, and by the end of it, if I sat down, I would be asleep in literally. <laughs> yeah. I love that smiley. I had that problem this yeah, morning. Yeah, that smiley's great. Oh, super cool, says I've done 33. Hey, sweet. I don't know what the longest I've gone is. I've never, like, timed it. I pulled a lot of all-nighters in film school, though, so it was probably pretty long. But I'm also a big fan of naps, so... Naps are a wonderful thing. I don't know. I never, never tested it. Oh, and you're still hosted, so take care for now. Good luck with the donations. Thank you, Redmaker! Yeah, thanks. so much. We'll see you tomorrow. Thanks. <laughs> I like when they try to sidestep, like... This will get away. Like they try to do the rolling into the wall or something. Oh, yeah. Do it. Trail of bodies. Trail of bodies. Yeah, Chloe says I can caffeine if I need it, though. Yeah, and I mean, sometimes during this, I'll, like, have a Mountain Dew, which for me is a lot of caffeine, since I don't. I will do the thing I'm not supposed to do and have the caffeine, but... Go, go, go. That's about it. Like, I can have, like, a coffee. I'm pretty good a with a too. coffee and, like, a Coke. Alright. Okay. So this time, don't go kill Sean. Go seven. Okay. I know the instinct is kill Sean Bean. Where are you go? There he is. Yeah. I, I know Sean you look at Sean Bean there. and you think, I should shoot that man. He doesn't even have a lies? face. Why has he lasted this long? But fight it. For England, James. 
for England, Alec. And put them on. So switch to the remote mode. Now put them on there. So pull the trigger. Now put one on each of those. Yeah, just pull them on. Bond and the other half? Uh, put Fate. the last one on the end. Alright, now get away from it and pull the trigger with your watching hand. Switch to the watching hand. So calm and collective. Hey! Alright. A little more accurate this time. Uh, the PP7 silenced is my preferred weapon. Now I have to find a plane ignition key and escape in a plane. I don't know how to fly a plane, but I guess I'll learn. Uh, Schumann says the 27 hours was he was trying to reboot his sleep timetable. Woke up at 6 p.m. and thought this is not going to work, and decided to try and stay up till bedtime the following day. It actually worked really well. I tried it again more recently, it didn't work quite so well. <laughs> I uh, I did something very similar. I assume Schumann was this because you were working a graveyard shift. Parents is going to my whole life. Where am I even going? There's a tank. Can I take the tank? It's a complaint. Deft Hitman says, I turned on my Xbox on last night, saw this stream when I was supposed to be playing games, and six hours later, it was 2.30. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, charity streams are another reason why I end up messing up my sleep schedule. Not just doing them, but, but watching. Yeah, watching them. <laughs> uh, which, uh... Alright, yeah, I don't see thing. anything from here yet. Yeah. I'll go back inside. No, no. Chloe says, really but I also right. don't usually have to do things at regular human times. That's uh, true. You have a more interesting schedule than, than other people. I can't see where I'm firing. You got it. Oh, jeez. Bystanders, fear me. Fear me. <laughs> Bystanders fear you? They should. There's an A-plane. Someone in a uh, bunker. No, they're just. Well, no, you've got to go in that bunker, I think. We're pretty sure that's where the. Uh, uh, oh, Def Tipman says, I had to be up at 7 with my kids. Oops! Uh, like Chloe said, our bad. We did not mean to be that entertaining. Yes, we did. We did. Uh, this is not going to be a successful vision. Slap him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Chloe says, Could you now? <laughs> yeah, Def Tip Man, if you can take a nap, I mean, if there's kids in your life, it might be hard. Kids are like the anti nap. Ugh, the anti nap. They don't want a nap. They get cranky if they don't have a nap. Uh, and they definitely want like, a <laughs> nap. No. She would say, when they become teenagers, it'll become, I had to be up at noon with my kids. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's try this again. I had to kick my children out of bed at 2 p.m. All right, so I've got hand grenades. I think that's what I need to use for the bunker. Yeah, that right? makes okay. sense. I feel like that's what they're almost asking you to. Uh, Probably. Now, is there anything in there? On the left? <laughs> no talking. <laughs> We're done here. Uh, 
this, this gentleman. Oh, there's the key. Well, I'm glad. <laughs> glad we went there instead of looked all the way around the yeah. plane. That's all you need. So now right? I just have to get in a plane? plane. I, I just have to get in a plane. I don't have to throw hand grenades at men in bunkers. I don't have to go all the way around this frozen wasteland. I don't have to look at a tank. I just get in the plane. Yes. Yeah. Great. <laughs> Is that what you're telling me? Is that what you're saying? To the plane! Deft Hitman says, uh, uh, lucky it's a Saturday. Yeah. True. It's true facts. Go. Play. 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 Crouch. No, that, that's... No. <laughs> Stop. Stop. I stopped crouching. And then just, uh, press B just... on the door. Oh, yeah. Not even that. Look at me! Secret agent. Every day. <laughs> Limb hits one. Twenty-five percent. Oh, you can get the uh, the tank. It's cold in Siberia. It's always cold in Siberia. Four years ago. Nah, I don't care. Don't care. Look at me in the snow trooper outfit. Snow job of G.I. Joe, that's who I used to be. Ba -ba -ba. <laughs> You're buzzing. No, because I just heard the phone. No, it's was... mine. Oh. oh. I think mine's also behind you. Oh, that was a boom boom? Yeah. Okay, cool. That was, that was going slightly crazy. I was well, this isn't texting very Grant to tell him that Gary was in the chat. Do I get a snowmobile or something? No. Come on, it's Nintendo 64. Yeah, Did you get a snowmobile? Yeah, 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 yeah. In Banjo Kazooie, you could fly even though you were a bear. Uh, yeah, I'm watching in the UK, so the time difference is mental. Oh, goodness. Ah. <laughs> yes. Well, I mean, the good news is we go 24 hours a day for this weekend, so you can watch whenever your schedule permits. Chase Bond used to be G.I. Yeah, Joe, Master. says Chloe. <laughs> Apparently. G.I. Joe. A real British hero. <laughs> I thought this was going to be a block puzzle at first. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Because we've got to unlock the water temple in Goldeneye. Yeah. No, that's, that's the next objective. Unlock the water temple. <laughs> yeah. I should have known it would be blocked again. Damn Russians. Door locked my butt. That's a wooden door. Yeah. That's probably reinforced. You're reinforced. Thank you. <laughs> Chloe says, oh, it's almost bedtime then? Don't tell him. What's up in this house? Yeah. Barrels. And at the top, there's someone chasing me. All I know is this game is making me a touch motion sick, so... Alright. I think so. I guess I need to walk straight forward. Down these stairs, James. Come on. Come on. You got it in. You can do it. No, whoa. Hello, friend. Bye-bye. Oh, toward pictures. the satellite! I get it. Yeah. It was obscured in Nintendo 64 fog for quite some time. <laughs> Man, we are at 94 people. We'll get clean water Woo! access. That's like awesome. Seriously, yeah. folks. We we just need ha ha ha! Surprise you! We need ah, to get you were surprised six more. I mean, we definitely need to get this above. Three thousand is the 100 people mark. It costs thirty dollars to. Uh, we're so almost there. I got two more hours yeah. on my player one shift. I'd be so to squeal with delight. We we really should get there. It's I think it's I think it's good. I think it's important. We're into we're getting into prime time now. Right. So see some donations for some some fun games. Let's see what uh, what hasn't gotten any love yet. Oh man, a lot of stuff. <laughs> no, there's so much stuff that hasn't even been touched. Uh, oh, we have more mystery games. Yes. Don't forget about those. Uh, Hannah I don't Montana. know what's in there. Chip does, but did. He got Men in Black Memory wiped. Hi, I'm um. Chip. <laughs> nice to meet you. 
Alright, well, I'm here what? now. <laughs> <laughs> um, haha, no kids and partner in bed. I'm planning on enjoying my bottle of whiskey, lol. There you oh, go. Oh, sounds good. Oh, The Rock is back. So it's just awesome. I love what you guys are doing for charity. You should be proud of yourselves and the lights just turned off. Thank goodness we have our own lights. And uh, honestly, that um, makes it a little easier to see you on my end, at least. So. Yeah. So. Uh, I will go take a look and see how we look. Yeah. We should be okay because yeah, I mean, we have lights, but ambient. Yeah, and like it's a little dark, but not. I mean, like I can see. Maybe I get in the door through here. But I'll go see if I can figure out where those lights are. Yeah. I mean, actually, it's kind of nice because there's no more. It um, might be reflection on that game yeah. cabinet. <laughs> <laughs> when we have a the third dark. light, we could set up if we wanted. Oh, yeah. Lee, she says everything is still very clear. Okay, okay. I got that's all I needed. Yeah, I wonder if it's a. Uh, I want to go see if I can figure out. Oh, oh, they turned it back on. Actually, it was better off. <laughs> I, I am wonder lost if it's like a, uh, a small child. Yeah, I wonder oh. if it's a uh, motion sensor, like because you and I oh, are stable okay. right now. Maybe. Oh, yeah. weird. I think that's what it is. What do I even do? Yay, lethargy. <laughs> I can't be bothered. Alright, I've forgotten my mission. Oh, yeah. Uh, enter base. Power down comms dish, enter base via ventilation tower. Okay, so you gotta go back to the comms dish. Comms um, dish. I guess I have to lay some mines. Uh, it says power down, but yeah, that might be it. Uh, yeah, try putting them down. Oh, uh, Surface One was supposed to have snipers use the watchtower, but the AI wasn't capable of seeing over railings, so they only fire on you if you actually climb into the watchtower. Wow. That's good to know. Well, I've got a sniper rifle that I can use as a bunt, I guess, if someone throws me a baseball. So that's good. Yeah, is there a computer game somewhere? Not outside. Okay, what about this Yeah! Ah. Try, uh, yeah. Ooh. Okay, that's good. <laughs> you just control deleted that mission. Oh, there was another door that went to that door. Now you gotta get to the ventilation tower. Oh, Chloe told me to walk around more? Yeah, um, I think it might be that it's on a motion sensor. And because oh. all three of us were stable for so long, <laughs> like one set went out. And, and then I and, got up to check it. Yeah, the it's gotta be one of the sensors over there. Okay. Because it happened right as you walked out. Oh, okay. Right, that was the tower. Where should we go next? Well, we're we'll trying go. to go to the ventilation tower. Now we know what happened. Tell you. Just stay put. <laughs> well, here's the tower. What's here? Did you find the communism room key? <laughs> we did not find the communism room key. No, that's in a later level. Let's look around. What could possibly be the ventilation room? Uh, Back that way. What's that out there? I'll go take a look. There was something with a locked door before. Wouldn't that be great? And then I just slide on my belly like a, like a penguin. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what else hasn't gotten love on our list? Yeah, I was just about to bring up the uh, list of available games. Ocarina and Twilight Princess. Oh, yes. yes. More Zelda action awaits. Zelda games. Games, uh, yes. This one's locked. Um, Mario 64. Yep. Chip, when you go sleep, how much longer till we get the J-Joy <laughs> Chip. The joy, 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 joy that is Chip. Yay. Um, I My shift officially ends at 8. But I'll probably hang out a little bit. Yeah. The ventilation thingy is a stumpy little cylinder with a ladder on the side. Oh. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you very much. Climb up it and shoot the locks off. Okay. That sounds pretty awesome. So let's see. Um, that looks like a cylinder. Nope. No, that's one nope. of the... You're looking for a, like an actual... An actual cylinder. Yeah. Because those are all watchtowers. Okay. It's going to still be off of the path, though, because this is the kind of game that it's set up the critical path. All right, how are we doing on time? Five uh, minutes till the spin. All right. Well, we'll see if we find it and complete our mission in five minutes. I believe you will. No, no, you got 15 to find it. That's true. Okay, this is the starting place. All right. Back or right. I'm going to go on top of the snow this time because I am a rugged British man. <laughs> She's very rugged, James. Quite. Uh, so, Superman 64 has not really gotten any love. Oh, that uh, game broke. 
Oh yeah, we actually yeah. accidentally lit it on fire and threw it out the window. Yeah. Don't Looks. donate for it. <laughs> is that's that? A, no, look. This is a house. No, no, below. Oh, straight below it. See that? Or is that another house? Roof? I can't tell. Let me yeah, keep going. I think it's a house roof. Uh, Super Metroid. Oh that's yeah, one. good gravy. Give to Super Metroid, everyone. Super good Metroid. Gravy. That game's so good. House. I think, Goose. I think we got all the all the Super Mario's except Super Mario 64. We got some for 3D World, I know. And we got some for World, correct? Yes, yeah, World is in the top five right now. Yeah. Um, obviously Steel Battalions gets a look. Star Wars Shadow of the Empire. That hasn't gotten any attention yet. Some Star Wars. Explorers. A large says, oops. Wop. I think that oops was to when we set it on fire and threw it out. Yeah, the yeah, I think so. Yeah, I don't. I mean, it was an accident. Mm -hmm. Total accident. Okay, there definitely the can't buy replacement copies. Wasn't for there like something that was like a weird observatory? Is that it over there? Oh, Grant says more mystery game donations, please. Yeah, seriously, guys, you you want these games? Yeah. They've both yeah. been good so far. The two out of like the what six mystery games we played are both. There are great. ten. Hey, there ten are ten mystery games. There are ten so there are games. eight left. It's not this, right? No. It's not in, I want to know what they are. Like, I'm face. To see. Because I have a lot of fun with uh, Wario. Yeah, WarioWare. I'm Wario glad Wario you got Wario. to play that stuff. Yeah. Uh, lost. Well, we've just in the snow. <laughs> so much snow. No, where to go? Try going past those. And this uh, Yeah. Like. Beyond this? the thing. How far is what from the top five? No, no, the. Uh, How Tom far Star. is which mystery game? No, I don't think I've been here. No, I've been this area. Huh. Mystery game currently has nothing. It has not been donated for since we last played it. So, the observatory is just prettiness. It doesn't really have any significance yeah. to the mission, I think. It okay. doesn't. Well, alright, I'll go on my way then. Try going left out of here. I want my snowball wheel. <laughs> snowball wheel. I, I want my snowball bow. James Bond wants his snowball bow and he wants it right now. And, uh. Let's see. What? This is some nonsense. No, uh. There hasn't been any. Uh, Don't hit that. Silent Hill. We've got two Silent Hill games. Oh, yeah, Shattered Memories is on there. Yep, Shattered that's, Memories uh, and Silent Hill 2, or also known as you Don't Put Your Hand in There, the game. I wanted to say hi, it's all some ghost deputies. There's also one in the Carrington Villa in Whee! Perfect Dark. Okay. Um, Shadow of the Colossus, I don't oh, think. Man. Oh, I lo love that game. And, and I guess it's kind of a sister game there. I've not, have not had the attention this year. So wait, yes. the ventilation is not in the same building as the dish? No, is that it's, it? yeah, it's a separate thing. It looks, it seriously looks like the top of a soda can. Oh, oh, here's a good one. Razor Freestyle Scooter. Oh, gosh, The Razor yeah. Scooter game. Sweet. <laughs> it's like uh, Tony Hawk, but Razor Scooter and dumb. Ooh, um, yeah. All right, Superboy I'm says she's saving a Silent Hill 2 donation about. for Dev Step. All right. Keep going that way. Going this way. Nice. That's where we came from. Yeah, that's all right. Well, that's something that looks like a That's game. it. That's it. That's it. Oh, thank you. Uh, ladder on the edge there, climb up, and then shoot the logs. How are they supposed to find that in all the snow? Come on, it's painted white. It stands <laughs> out. Yeah, you just climb up there, shoot the four logs. Yeah. All righty. What are our top five? Alright, let me let me do a refresh, a couple refreshes here. Make sure none of you snuck in any donations there while I was talking. Okay. Nope. Alright. Then uh, our top five are Hello Kitty Cube Frenzy. Wow. Battle Toads, Super Mario World, Aquanauts Holiday, and Steel oh. Battalion. Oh god. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> All right, are we ready? Are you ready for some button mashing of a steel Italian? Hello, sir. I think we are. I, I don't, I don't like you at all. Good, good. Uh, number four. Number four is Aquanauts Holiday. Woo! All right, sounds good to me. Weird 
tell everybody. <laughs> PS1 game. All right. So now our wonderful Lychee mods will <sighs> take all of Aquanauts Holidays points away, and we'll have a new top five. Ugh, that was so that complicated. You have one hour to effect, and I believe that now you will be donating for the last hour of Tracy's shift. So think real hard about what else you would want to see out of Tracy and get those donations uh, in. Yep. Think real hard about donating $31 for Mystery Game. That would put it in the number five spot and would give uh, someone clean water for life. So that's pretty good. You know, it's not its not all the time during this that you can do just like a $30 donation and get a game in the top five. You're, you're watching at a very specific time between when we had a bunch of large numbers and we will predictably again um, as we get into tomorrow, so. This is the best time to donate and get things into the top five. You have it takes a little less, a little less money to do so. You can get more than one game in the top five, and you can uh, you can name more than one game in a donation. You know, just button, push button, push button. tell us how you want us to split it up. So, if you were to donate sixty dollars and say half for mystery game and half for I don't know, Tale of the Sun. We could do that. We know how to do that. You could even say ten dollars for this one, eighteen dollars for that one. You can be specific as long as they are, you know, as long as you use whole sets. We can do that. Get out of here, nerd. Oh, Pope Spidey is leaving us back. I Pope Spidey. So, yes, Aquanauts holidays. Aquanauts so Holiday. Fun. I never played Aquanauts Holiday. Pretty much no one has. Well, I'm glad to be among the few that have. Yeah. It's, um, so the, Tracy, did you get to see Tale of the Sun? Yes. Same company, same what? director. Oh my god, okay. Yeah. Uh, Alright, so for some truly bizarre PS1 era graphic oh yeah. weirdness. Yep. Yep. Weird. Hey, I got a key card. Weird, kind of ugly, terrible graphics, and, uh, just generally weird gameplay. Oh. If you want to call it gameplay, it's a sandbox game, that's for sure. Yeah. And now that I'm going into a colon, it looks like. Mm -hmm. That is not an incorrect statement. <laughs> Chloe says, I did $2 and $3 and $15 earlier. Exactly. We can split it up any way you want for different games. Uh, so don't feel like you have to make multiple donations to make it happen or do anything. You know, you can just say it in your comment on the donation. We can do it. Alright. Oh god, that was the toughest camera. Yeah, what's your objective right now? Um, I got the key card. Now I have to take a picture of the screen. Hey, a box of explosions. I'm just going for it. And more colon, look at that. I always wanted to video, be in a colon. Video game colon. It's just like built into the side of something that's so Oh, great. Well, All now look what you did. Now there's Harper for days. <laughs> I'm gonna grab some more water before it's time to switch the game. Mm -hmm. While well, I can. Do it. You got five minutes. Five minutes. Somebody here. Good. In and out of the colon we go. And I'll get, uh, I'll make sure to give you all the uh, buttons and such for Aquanauts. Okay. It's pretty straightforward, um, but it's also just very much like, well, you're just going to be kind of floating. <laughs> I can do that for now. An oddity about Bunker is that despite the fact that the person identified as programmer is Boris for the film, you can actually kill him without the penalty at the end of the level. I forget whether he's required for one of the agent objectives. Yeah, that's who Tracy just put down right at the start of the mission. <laughs> <laughs> she said, I don't tolerate nerds. Well, let's, uh, let's yeah, all right then. Objective? Oh, you gotta take a picture of that screen. I, I guess. Which, uh, that's gonna make, uh, you're gonna have to definitely remember those guys. She puts them down. 
down you go, take a nap. You are tired. You are very, very tired, man. Tired, man. Tired, man. Uh, one of your uh, weapons is a camera. No, it's not. Try pausing. Go over once. Keep going down. There it is. Camera. Okay, now you have it selected. Now. Just pull the trigger. That's weird. I thought that was all there was to it. Oh yeah, it's in the inventory, but it's like, I don't know, drop it or something? Or? No, you can't drop it. You are all very ugly and you are ruining my day. You, you made me lose my connection. What are you doing wearing sunglasses inside of a giant colon secret I place anyway? Not. You done left it, Steph. Well, I mean, I guess it did, but... Alright. Try again? Yeah, it's gotta be a matter of selecting it. Ah! And I have two pistols. Yeah. Goodbye. Not for long. Yeah, I think you do have to select it from your watch. The golden eye key? Oh, copy it. Okay, got the key. Keep going over. Let's see what you're. Oh, well, it's going my way then. Oh, no, I, <laughs> I just threw it. I didn't think. You have to pick it up, use the key analyzer, and then use the key to throw it back. So. I want Todd Sarah to play Pokemon. Strategic donations. Says Superboy. Fall away from here! Ew! Someone put jelly all over you! <laughs> Ew! Alright, did you re pick up the golden icon? Yes. Alright, so now pause. Uh, 95 people will get clean water. We're, we're getting yeah. there. So now you need we're the item there. that's called the Data Thief. Data Thief. No, 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 Deft Hitman has a very good question. How long after the stream can you donate? Donations will be open until June 30th, uh, at which point Charity Water will close down the campaign to send the money off to the field workers in Uganda to get the well started. Uh, Guns Kimbo, James Bond. Uh, it is time to stop. Okay. Time to stop. Unarmed. Well, I got two guns in one hand. Or rather, two guns and two hands. <laughs> so yeah, if you um, if you want to donate after the stream, you certainly still can up until June thirtieth. That's also um, about the time when we'll stop selling the shirts and such with the Uganda colors on them. So if you want any swag or merch, as it were, swag and merch, you have up until uh, June thirtieth as well. So, why didn't that work? Oh, because the thing crashed. Um, so, yeah. And all the profits from buying a shirt or a scarf 
or a sticker or a tote bag with the Uganda UPIC logo on it will go to the Charity Water Campaign. So of course we will be shutting that down around the time that we can no longer donate your profits to the campaign. Um, so yes, so through about June 29th, you can buy those. June 30th is my birthday. Yay, Tracy's birthday. Okay. Tracy, keep talking to the people. Uh, I was born on June 30th, 1986. I'm a Cancer. My sign is a crab. And Gengar and I, really, we're just going to be celebrating it probably at the pool. Oh, wow, it really is just me here. Everybody else has left camera. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Do you have any info about how much the swag donation would be? Can I buy a tote bag with the PBS logo on it? No, that's a different fundraiser entirely. You're going to have to ask Matt Lauer about that personally. Or, um, oh, no, sorry. Matt Lauer works for Good Morning America. You can see if Good Morning America has tote bags. That might help. Oh, gosh. You know, I've never seen Goldeneye, and I don't know if I should, because I'm not sure how much I care about Pierce Brosnan. Shimon, what you can do is buy me a tote bag with the PBS logo on it. Does that sound like a bargain? We can trade tote bags. You can have one of mine that's just kind of in my cupboard. Hello, Night Vale in 28. I forgot to comment. Uh, I love Night Vale. I love your username. Who else is here with us? Daniel Craig all the way from Lychee. I don't know, I still, I still personally find the old ones with Sean Connery, I mean, of signs of the times as they are, they're actually weirdly relaxing. Because there's like the big cars doing all the car chases, or there's just, it's a slower story, they're actually there on location, whether it's like a Tokyo, the spy who loved me, or you know, those beautiful oceans and Thunderball. So, <laughs> products of the 60s that they are, I really love watching those. Most of Brosnan's Bond films that are not Goldeneye are not that good. I think you're right. I don't know. I'm sure that, you know, some people are attached to Pierce Brosnan. He's like, he's my James Bond. Like, some people might say that. Like, we say, oh, that's my doctor for Doctor Who. Have I seen Living Daylights? No, I haven't. Is that another Pierce Brosnan uh, vehicle, would you say? Timothy Dalton is your favorite Bond. No, I don't think you're alone. I think there is a small but comfortable, quiet minority who does believe Timothy Dalton was the best. I would say it's analogous to uh, people think John Putri is the best doctor. Deaf conversations are pretty weird right now. This is just me and Gengar. <laughs> oh, what else can we talk about? Game coming up. Uh, as Chip said, made by the same people's Tale of the Sun, which is one of our most popular games that we did in the 2013 broadcast. It was a, that is a weird one. I mean, not just because, you know, it was made with the graphical limitations of PS1, but it's just like, just wander around, like just explore and use the environment to your advantage as much as you can. You know, just like, just explore. I mean, again, one of those games that I love where you have nothing to tell you what's going on. Apparently I'm a big fan of that, so. All right, we're getting it up. I'm gonna switch to the PS1 controller. And we're gonna get everything set up here. Dollar's so strong, how do you do that, Dollar? <laughs> That PS1 noise, you can hear it, can't you? That's right, Sarah killed Mammoth after Mammoth in Tale of the Sun. Aquanauts Holiday, though, we'll see what that brings us. Uh, according to Chip, is a uh, just sort of languidly swim and explore things. I wonder if this is kind of like a proto spore almost. Like that was kind of, well, spore had objectives, of course, but the idea was sort of like make your own game, just, you know, very non linear, non stuck to the story. 